Hey, Alex here. We're gonna create this word by word caption style that you're seeing right now, all in Premiere Pro for free, no cropping or using any keyframes. To do this, you do need Premiere version 25.5 to use film impact effects. In this video, we're gonna use our free plugin and tool called the Transition Assistant to make this, which is going to help apply transitions to make better captions. This is not necessary, but it does help a lot and you can do this manually, but you'll save so much time using this tool. And yes, this is free to download and free to use as well. So why not use it, right? And if you want a full explanation on how this tool works, we have another video just for that. I have my sequence already transcribed and these are the properties that I have. We have enter bold at font 60 and it is a pretty basic graphic. We're gonna select our captions now, go to graphics and titles and upgrade caption to the graphic. Holding options and selecting all the clips, we're gonna duplicate it by moving it up one track. The first track up here is going to be our foreground and the bottom track, it is going to be our background. And we're gonna work on the background first. Let's toggle off the top track and in our property settings, we're gonna go down, fill, we can change it to whatever color we want. In this case, we're gonna do this kind of gray color and going down, we're gonna to toggle on the background. And for this, we can have whatever color. Let's make this this color, increase the opacity, increase the size a little bit more, and let's add some corners. Great, we're gonna to toggle this off first and we're gonna work on the foreground. Let's move this up a little bit. We're gonna select all the clips again. And in our plugin, the transition assistance, we're gonna go down and we're gonna stagger the clips. This is going to offset every other clip up one track to help apply our transitions. Again, you can do this manually. Selecting all the clips on our top track again and using our plugin, we're gonna to go to this part, the transition effects apply, and we're gonna type in the typewriter impact to apply the typewriter effect on all the clips. In this setting, we're gonna apply it only to the front of the clip and the duration, we're gonna apply by clip length. And right now we have it set at 70% and let's change it to 80. So it's going to apply the transition effect 80% of every clip. And we're gonna hit apply. And let's toggle back the background and let's see how this looks like. Hey, Alex here. As you can see, I am outside. If you find anything useful, please make sure to like and subscribe. We are a pretty new channel. We create editing tutorials, plugins, features. So if there's something that you want to see in Adobe Premiere, make sure you leave it in the comments below. Subscribe to our newsletter because you might get a discount. And yeah, thanks for watching.